one sec. Can you dig it, sucker? All right, again, I'm definitely going to do a wrestling things video. You know what? I might do that next. But okay, we're back with some more wrestling goodness. So, the current king of savage in WWE land to me right now is Samoa Joe. Um, but before Joe entered the hollowed grounds of WWE, the undisputed king of savage was definitely CM Punk. CM Punk is probably my third favorite wrestler of all time. So, of course, I miss the man. I'm going to do a video. Will he go to All Elite Wrestling? We will see. We'll do a video about that later. But I need some CM Punk goodness in my life every once in a while. So let's check out some of Sir Punk's most savage moments. So without further ado, let's jump in. Booker T had an awesome theme song. Great theme song. <laughs> God, Punk was so good on the mic. <laughs> oh my God! <laughs> my boy, Punk. Oh, well, and this was before everyone was doing it. To fight the COO of the WWE at Night of Champions. I want the cerebral assassin. I don't want the new you. The new you sucks. I want the old. <laughs> you want this? Come on. Lay the pipe on mommy, big guy. Come on, go ahead. <laughs> <laughs> There's one thing. Oh, classic. Classic am, moment. And that's kissing Vince McMahon's ass. And this was before everyone was Punching doing it. You gotta go ask your wife permission first. <laughs> Punk would take such shots. Oh, Johnny. Oh, my God. We'll screw you and your 38,000. Oh, I forgot about him. This. The, the nastiness. <laughs> Jersey. <laughs> I used to do this. I got two words for you. Jersey sucks. <laughs> Man, Straight Edge Society was family. great. But you do wear her panties, don't you? This man but, right uh, here. Don't let me do all the talking. Why don't you let everybody know exactly how intimate me and you were behind closed doors? <laughs> <laughs> Takes on different meaning now, but anyway. <laughs> oh. I'll kick you in the nuts and you'll smile at me and like it and show me some respect. Number one thing, Mr. I want Punk. You to bring back the WWE ice cream bars. <laughs> and one last thing, uh, the man, man, the summer of punk in day day was Cena so great. Against your buddy Dwayne, against <laughs> the Rock. Who watches bad Disney movies? <laughs> you have become the New York Yankees. You need to watch your mouth. You need to watch the show. I do whatever I want to whomever I please. God, I miss I punk, punk man. Randy, I don't take joy rides on my motorcycle at 3 a.m. and try to pop wheelies and get re injured. <laughs> So he just made everything feel so real. I know where that hand's been. I do understand considering that this dude nor Pac-Man have any testicles whatsoever. The unadulterated savagery of this man. Punk. Man, I miss my I man Punk. While you're lying in bed with your wife. Oh, oh. My initiation will be the ultimate sacrifice. And it is my hope. Oh, come on. Oh, no, don't, don't, no, 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 no. How 
gullible are all of these people. <laughs> Wearing a harness. Yeah. You are all, no, congratulations, legitimately, you are all the biggest mindless group of sheep. Dude, whatever he was doing, he just life. made it so much better. Leader of the, the Nexus. Leader of we straight in society. We did that. That's funny. Because I don't remember telling any of you that you could be happy. <laughs> Get on your knees. <laughs> you're only happy when I say you're happy. To make sure it's okay. And by board of directors, I mean your wife. And you've been slapping me in the face for years. And then as a Paul Heyman guy. Yo! Yo, I forgot about that. And now that's a slap in your face. I'm sorry. I... Do you have a license? I'm sorry. I didn't hear a word you were saying. I wasn't paying attention. I apologize. Yeah, you didn't pay attention in wrestling school either, jerk. <laughs> I have your word. Well, that used to mean something. But now your word is nothing coming from a seven foot tall sellout suck up. Oh, man. Hold on a second, hold on a second. Hold it right about here. So <laughs> <laughs> oh, take the bit. Dog, man. I, I just imagine how great Punk would have been if they didn't cut the rug out from under him. Kind of like looking in the mirror, isn't it, Hunter? I got in trouble basically because I have the balls to say things that nobody else has the balls to say. Legit. Hey, Vicky, if I'm the voice of the voiceless, you're the voice of the pointless. <laughs> I'm, I'm the Oh, oh if she would take her. Yeah, Eric, hold on, I remember I think you got in trouble for that. But he made it work with Taker too. Man, Punk just made everything work. Because I'm going to be in jail. You want to guess what I'm going to be in jail for? Animal cruelty. Because I'm going to beat you like a bitch. Ho oh. <laughs> ho! If Triple H asked you to jump off a bridge, would you? Because I think that would be good for business. <laughs> I'm just the just My punk apologies for your loss at WrestleMania. Ah uh, man, I wish him well in his return, but I so hope to hear cult of personality again. Sometimes it's what you don't do that makes you who you are. Oh, oh my it's, I was, it's, how was your movie by the way? Uh, I missed it. Mine mine went straight to DVD just like yours. <laughs> <laughs> See all these people here. Wishing they had a remote in their hand so they could fast forward any time you have a microphone in your hand. Oh god, I forgot when Cole was like exactly doing that anonymous general did manager you thing. The big red ass kisser. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Corporate King. Take your vitamins. I get what you're saying, brother. Straight edge society, dude. I thought you said something about being entertaining. Certainly we've got similarities. Oh, I wanted that no so bad. Mm. He's the first superstar to cash in his money in the bank contract and lose. He's a loser like everybody in Philadelphia, and he's a loser like you. <laughs> Sir, you paid your ticket. You want to boot Dude, fine, uh, I, dare, I, I dare you to step in between. That punk went in on that guy. Again. Don't you have the <laughs> the punk I went off on this man. Oh man. I took them out. You took them out? Like on a date? <laughs> <laughs> Fuck is stupid. You don't like it when I just grab things out of your hand, do you? Let me tell you what you're going to do about it. Absolutely nothing. nothing. <laughs> a whole lot of nothing. But oh boy, oh boy, did you ever suck. want to see the text message my little sister Shaleen sent me last night? There, here it is. 
OMG, Kevin Nash, WTF, thought he was dead. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> it's just your career that's dead, right? Punk makes you want to punch him, man. I give these people mm, about a week before they move on to the next new thing. Yep. Yeah, dude, they've been going on and on, man. We miss them. <laughs> I like the edit. I like the edit in. Dog, I miss my man, Punk. <laughs> I like this edit. <laughs> oh, man, that, I like that edit. Duh, oh, man, that was great. I miss Punk. I miss Punk. Before Samoa Joe talking smack, and when, like, people had a... It seems like they have a bit more free reign now on the mic. In a time when everything was so scripted, everybody sounded the same, Punk was just a breath of fresh air. And I definitely miss my man on the mic and in the ring. He, I know he put in a great career, great career, Hall of Fame career, definitely. I would love to see him back in the ring, even if it is just for the go off, the send home match to get before he goes into the Hall of Fame, be it in WWE, if he goes to All Elite Wrestling. Um, this isn't just like, oh, wrestling sucks now that Punk gone, because wrestling's doing awesome. Wrestling is doing great. But it would just be so much greater if we heard Cult of Personality. And then Punk came out, said his clobbering time, and went to work in the ring. But that's all for now. Like, share, subscribe, all that goodness. Until next time, my people, peace and positivity. <laughs>